again welcome back to the channel on this video as we are out here for a ride in the overcast sky we've had rain today which is rare to have in the summer uh, in these parts in the months of July and August as we close out the month of July and it feels more like fall today the temperature is not getting out of the 60s today it's like 64 degrees right now and that might be as high as we get to maybe we'll go a degree more but so anyway on this video I wanted to talk about Magicycle and specifically a new model e-bike that Magicycle has out and it is called the CT1 commuter and uh, boy, I'll tell you, just uh, by the looks of it, I really like the look of this bike. It is a, as it says, a commuter bike. And the one thing about this bike that might be appealing to some people is the fact that it's only uh, 54 pounds. So it's not a great big... Heavyweight bike, and I want to. I want to go down this other way. Uh, 54 pounds is certainly uh, for an electric bike a nice weight. As far as if you uh, are worried about uh, the bike being too uh, heavy to ha handle and balance, uh, 54 pounds is good. That's a, that'll feel like a lightweight bike if you're used to. Uh, Anybody that's out there, it's used to riding like a more of a 75 to 80 pound bike. But uh, so it does come in several different colors, and I will leave a link in the description if you want to check out uh, just what colors it has to offer. And let's talk a little bit about some of the uh, specs that this bike has to offer. So first of all, let's talk about the motor. So it's a 48 volt, 750 watt motor that peaks at 1100 watts. And let's talk about the battery. So the battery is also 48 volts, of course, and it is a 15 amp hour. And they're saying the range is 60 plus miles. Well, okay. Um, I don't think you're going to get 60 plus miles, but we'll go with that. Um, that would, of course, be in the lowest pedal assist level one. If you're going to get that at all. I don't know. I, I, but anyway, that's what they're saying, 60 plus miles. So we'll go with that. Because I don't know. I haven't done a range test or anything like that. So I don't know. Uh, for sure, but uh, I have my doubts on that one. It does have seven speed, Shimano seven speed, and the pedal assist, there are seven pedal assist levels. Something else interesting about this bike is, and they're starting to do this, uh, Magicycle has done this now with a couple of different of their bikes now. And that is having two sensor choices. You can switch back and forth, which is really cool. It kind of, if you feel like riding with the torque sensor one day, you can do that. And then another day, hey, if you want to ride with cadence sensor, you can do that. Or let's say you're sharing that bike with uh, husband, wife, child, and one of them prefers one of the sensors over the other then you can switch to whichever one you want i i think that's a good idea and uh it's something different and uh i like the fact that they uh, are doing that i should mention about the uh top speed so with pedal assist the top speed is 25 miles per hour. They're calling it class two. It's class two and a half, I guess, if you uh, look at it. It's halfway or slightly more toward class three. 
but I guess because it's less than 28 miles per hour, they're saying uh, class two. It's kind of confusing there because I thought class two was 20 miles per hour maximum. But oh well, they're calling it class two and with pedal assist it goes up to 25. I assume, but I didn't see nothing on this, that the class two with just throttle is going to be 20 miles per hour. So speaking of throttle, it has a half twist throttle. talk a little bit about the tires so the tires are not as wide on this bike they're 26 by 2.1 so it's probably very nimble uh, for uh, maneuvering and handling and that's probably part of the lighter weight uh, being the narrower tires The weight of this bike I mentioned earlier was 54 pounds, but I didn't mention the payload capacity. How about this, a whopping 400 pounds. So if you take the 54 pounds off of the 400, that leaves you with 346 pounds. You can be a big dude and ride this bike, or you could have a nice uh, cargo, uh, this because it does come with a rack, you can load up some on the cargo rack then. And uh, that's pretty good. It does have hydraulic uh, disc brakes. I'm trying to think what else the bike has. It's a really stylish, good-looking bike. I, I mentioned that earlier. I like the look of this bike quite a bit. And I think this one's going to uh, gonna sell some. I think people, some people are going to find this bike very appealing. I think that's pretty much all of the basics for this bike and I haven't mentioned the price yet so let's talk about the price so it's currently running at $1,599 and free shipping in the 48 lower uh, lower 48 states and if you uh, would like to purchase this bike I do have a discount code so if you want to uh, Check out my affiliate link in the description and then go to the site and in the uh, for coupon code just type in MK100 or MK100 and that will save you $100 uh, on the purchase of this bike taking you down to $14.99. Like I said, I think this bike is going to be uh, popular. So that's it. That's the CT1 commuter new model out by Magicycle. Check it out. I'll leave a link in the description. And don't forget, if you are interested in purchasing this bike, to uh, go ahead and hit the affiliate code, the link that I uh, will drop in here in the description, and then just type in the uh, code number or code, coupon code, MK100, MK100 will get you $100 off the purchase of this bike. So that's going to do it for this video. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, just hit that subscribe button, and thank you very much for doing that. 
if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel just hit that notification bell and hey if you want to comment on this video or any other video on the channel just go ahead and leave your comment in the comments below once again thank you for joining me on this video with the ct1 commuter by my cycle so until next time keep your wheels on the road see you later